Hello, I'd like to explain an internet radio concept I've developed over the years. It's a mixture of uh, live but pre-recorded. So the programs are made in advance but triggered to go live at a specific time. So you have the excitement of a live broad broadcast without the stress associated with it. And after your program has gone live, it becomes like the BBC Listen Again. It wasn't there until it went live at a specific time, but afterwards it could be listened to at any time. Here's a project I worked on earlier with a school in North Townside called Word FM. And they produced a series of programmes based around statements delivered by. Let's have a listen to the first one, which was a trailer for all the subsequent programmes. Hello Europe and welcome to Word FM Radio to Live By, broadcasting for the very first time ever out of our friends all over Europe from our base at Holy Cross Primary School in Howden, North Tyneside here in England. My name is Sophia. Just one of the team here, we will be bringing you radio shows packed with music, poetry and chat, as well as great guests. And the programme's got lots of comments and people all over the world checked out their programmes from the United States all the way to Australia and lots in Europe and even some in uh, Africa. Now this is what a compiled radio programme looked like. As you can see there are lots of separate audio clips put together to make the final programme and uh, the children worked in different teams producing different parts that were eventually all brought together to produce the radio show. So if we have several teams producing radio programs and scheduling them to go live at specific times, like for instance, one group decides to produce a show and it can be quite short, 10 to 15 minutes, that they're going to release at 3 p.m. on Mondays. And they do that every Monday and we have a broadcast schedule a little bit like that. Another team produces a program that they schedule for 2 p.m. on Tuesdays. And it looks like that. So if you get another team that produces a series of programs, perhaps for 3 p.m. on Tuesdays, you can see how the schedule starts to fill up with different groups producing different programs and putting them into different time slots. And eventually, with more people producing regular content, the schedule starts to fill up a little bit like this, and you've got a vibrant radio station on the internet. If you'd like to have a chat about this concept and see if we can put a project in place, just please get in touch.